Hello, my name is Michael Evans. I'm Richard Children. I'm Blair X. Richard Hobie is not here with us. Today we're going to be playing Family Plots. And since we've opened it, we've released the curse, I'm sorry. We have family trees. Uh, it randomly determines what family members we need in order to win the game. On the back is a summary of how to play the game. Corner of the rules, you get one randomly. We altered that slightly. We we were given uh, two, chose one. The one we chose is, up, is upside down. So that way we can flip it up and look at it easier. And the one that we didn't choose is right side up. So that way we can look at it and see what we're doing. Okay, so now I'm going to grab the deck. It comes with this nice little board that shows you everything. That shows you everything. There's a draw pile. There's when you play action, action goes here. And when you discard cards, the discard card goes there. We're all going to get five cards. You guys did shuffle these, right? I did. Okay. I split the deck in half, shuffled each half, then split the halves into halves, combined the opposite halves, and shuffled those, then put it back together, cut it, put it back together. So these will go in the draw uh, plot. And have we determined who the first player is? Yes, me. Okay. The first player is the person who spoke to their mother the most recently. So it was really a toss between player X and Richard Shelton. I spoke to my mother today, he spoke to his mother yesterday. So, to start out with, uh, family time. This is where any family member or modifiers from your hand are placed in front of you. You only place family members from your family tree unless you immediately modify them. So you place one or more. Uh, I think it's as many as you uh, as you have, but only you can place as many of the fa fa many family members as you have in your hand that you can use, mm -hmm. but you can only play family members that you can use. Like I say, if your thing says you need grandma, grandpa, brother, fa mother, father, brother, sister, mm -hmm. pet, you cannot use an aunt. So if you have an aunt, it's just so, taking on space unless you can modify it somehow. I'm Daddy Sean. He can do it all. We model. We finish and fix that plumbing. So, I then draw up to five because I'm well, not playing an action. Well, the next step would be an action, playing an action card or a reaper card. Mm -hmm. He's not going to do that. Then you, uh, the graveyard phase, which you can discard up to one or two cards from your hand if you have any that you don't want mm -hmm. to get rid of. And then you draw up to your hand limit of five. It's not a limit of five. It's a minimum of five. Minimum of five. Sorry, yes, him. Well, it's a it's a limit. You can't go below that. Now, I'm going to take one of these. Now, all the cards, there are symbols on here. Uh, the cards, the family members' the cards will have the symbol in the corner to show you which one it is. So you can match up. So if it doesn't say father, mother, uh, rather than guessing, you look at the, the icon on your on the card. I'm going to show one from my hand, that the camera, not the other thing. Mm -hmm. So the icon is up here in the upper uh, left corner. And this one has been played as the icon yeah. for dad. Oh, geez, I could have put that one. Yes. So you look at the icon. You look, see if it matches the icon on here. If it does, you can play it. If it doesn't, you cannot. I've got Granny, nothing corn, turd psychic. Your future looks like crap. And I have Mrs. Donner. That's my Granny. I have Mrs. Donner, culinary cannibal. One day her neighbor came to dinner. You ate delicious. That's mother. So I can't play any more family members. My action time, however, I will steal two cards from player X because I'm just a jerk like that. So, and some of your times your family members will have actions as well. So when you play them, you can do the action. I'll play these two. I'm going to discard these two. When you discard cards, you put them face down. When you play actions, you put them face up. Now I have two cards left, so I will draw up to five. If you played a family member, and you have no more slot for that family member, but you found a family member you have you like better, you have to find a way to kill off your family member uh, that you have down already before you can play a new one. You can't just sacrifice it, you have to actually kill it off. So there's some that will say kill off one person, you can use it on yourself if you want to, or you can use it on someone else. That is my turn. Uncle Jimbo and Sister Wives. Steal one to two aunts or moms from any player's family. 
Can you play them all? Yes, I can. You can only steal uh, cards you can play as well. So that... And that's all the family I can play. Now for an action card. You have 10 seconds to add one card from the action pile into your hand. Another one, seven, two, seven, three. <laughs> I don't think you're allowed to stop them. Yeah, I know, but I got to put my hand on it first. <laughs> I think we all lose. <laughs> that was eight, that was nine, that was ten. Now, technically, it doesn't say whether you can stop someone from doing that or not. I had my hand on it first. I think technically Richard Sheldon was cheating, that's why I stopped counting. Well, no, I had my hand on it first. So, he was cheating by trying to take it after I had my hand on it first. You so, like, have. I'm guessing that means the player that Yeah, the player that plays it, yes. Yeah. Oh, you? Yes. yes you. Sorry, I thought it was every player. No, no, no. No, no. I thought everybody had that's what, Again, that's why I stopped counting. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, so then, once I've taken it, I can use the action card. Nope, because right? nope. you use an action card, you can only play one action turn, one and you use that action to steal reaper. that action. Okay. One action or, or reaper, reaper card. card, yes. So, the and reaper card. card one to two cards in your hand in the graveyard. Mm -hmm. Then draw back up to five cards. One, two, three, four, five. I will steal your uncle. Ooh. And those can be... Counted with a food fight. Okay. Counted with a food fight or... Counted with a food fight, an angel, or a... Unicorn tear. Unicorn tear. Food fight, atomic biscuits and gravy. Okay. So, this so. goes down, that goes down on top of it. And a food fight can be canceled with a food fight. Angel, I think an angel can count. No, angels only count death. A food fight or angel tear, yes. I believe. Or unicorn tear. Uh, angels and unicorns cannot be canceled. canceled. Yeah. So no, no, an angel, angel can be canceled by unicorn, unicorn tear. That's it. Yes. But angels only count her death, I believe. Playing Barbara. Puppy mill mantity. In case of death, grind before flushing. I'm not going to do an action. I am going to throw two cards. Four, two, three. Put down all the family cards I can. Yeah, okay. Same here. Action card. Psycho killer. Kill a family member from every player's family. I believe that includes you. Yep. So. Okay. I'm going to... No, it goes the face oh, down sorry. in the graveyard. So you discard at least one? No. No. You no. can choose to do one or two. Okay. You have to drop to your hand size. One, two, three, four, five. Now I was going to discard this one instead of play it. Family feud. Everybody loses a family member. Fight. Discard, discard. And get two more. Granny Chan. In Granny's basement, no one can hear them scream. Oh, it's mime collector. No one can scream. Because they're mimes, get it? And... Papa Z prunes, literally old school. Baby got back pains. I am going to grave roll from that ten seconds. Go to the go. Thousand, one thousand, two thousand, three thousand, four thousand, three thousand, two thousand, one. Bam! I'm going to draw two cards. The nuclear symbol means it's a modification for family. Step one. Family. Step two. Eh. Step three. Profit. Uncle Jimbo. Twins. Did you just? So you can. Family members are even played. Yes. So that and you can only do the action when it comes when it's played. So yes. in that case, it's wasted. Yeah. Now, do you need two uncles? Is the thing? Because you only do you modify something if is modify if you need the modifier. Oh. You can only have that, the family members you need for your family tree. All right. Now, if you had an uncle. And a sex change that you could make him an ad as you play him. And you can only use modifiers on things that you can modify. Like, I couldn't play sex change on a pet. No. Alright. But you could, let's say, turn a pet into a werewolf and um, yeah. make him your uncle. Yep. But pets are considered family members, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. If your family tree has pets listed on it. Yeah. Yes. So I can do a paternity test. And steal one family member. You 
Secure a creature. Uh, I think I'll discard a card, then draw. Discard that card. One, two, three. Okay. Bring me up to five. Okay. Um, I have nothing to do with either of you. I have no family members to play. I will discard these two cards and draw these two. Once more, I bring out Mrs. Donner. I will bring out Mr. Miggles, Pet Peeve, Mouse Breather, Loud Eater, Double Dipper, Nose Picker. And little sister Tina Ursa. Barely sane. Nobody puts Teddy in a corner. Nobody. I'm going to discard this card. I'm going to draw four. So first, the family. Tony the Brony. Says Twilight Sparkle is my life. Then Mercy, the animal lover. Hugs aren't really hugs if you if you can still breathe. And for my action or Reaper card, Captain Grimm, Super Reaper. With great power comes great reapability. Kill one player's entire family. And I have no angel or or. Unicorn tear to stop that. Okay, well, man, I do not think I shall uh, discard anything, so I have two cards left. Three, four, five. Well, first turn the family phase. El Dependo, the <laughs> AARP heavyweight wrestling champion. Then during the acting phase. Oh, do you know who. He has this beautiful family over there that Penny wants to play with them. Penny is the cutest reaper ever. <laughs> um, <laughs> the prestigious Penny and her bunny sprinkles would love to play with your entire family forever. Kill one player's entire family unless you have... Angel or a unicorn tier. Uh, nope. So it goes in... Oh, reapers are taken out of the game, yes. Okay. That's, what, that's the thing I forgot. That's what I keep forgetting when I play. So they go into... Yes. Face down. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to put Chum Chum, Card Shark. <laughs> when do you just want little Timmy to disappear? That's why I was giggling. And we were missing play. We we're skipping player X's turn. Oh. Mm -hmm. Big Daddy Cthulhu comes out to play. <laughs> Honey, and I'm home. And. I will discard this because I cannot use that family member. I will draw two. Okay, I'm playing Timothy, serial killer. Kill one family member for one player. I'm sorry, I'm going to kill Big Daddy Cthulhu. Big Daddy Cthulhu. Okay. I am going to discard him. Take two. Georgina, super special friends forever and ever and ever. Steal up to two brothers and sisters or babies from one player's family. You jerk. Ah, chum chum. We hardly knew ye. Now, for my action card, I'm going to steal two cards. One player's hand. Uh, to quote Airplane, looks like the foot's on the other hand now. Oh wait, no, because I cancel out of the food fight. Ooh. Now if you have a food fight, you can cancel the food fight with a food fight. Then see what happens. Now discard, discard, and then draw. Three, four, five. Okay, who has family members out? See, Sans coming there. Right. Someone's gonna do it. Kill, what is it? Kill one family. One family. The same as all the Reapers. And discard this. And take two. And really hope I get something I can play. Okay, I'm going to throw out at least one of these cards because I have dupes now. The modifiers. Next turn, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to. I have no family to play, but I'm going to steal two cards from your hand. Oh. <laughs> Tell you, Benjamin, be mine. And I have five cards now. Okay. Thank you for your generous donation. Uncle Ernest, camp counselor, schizophrenic know-it-all. Know what I mean? Yeah, I do. I will play a action or reaper card right now. Discard. 
and draw two, three, four, five. So, I have Edward measuring Cup's hands. I'm tossing this one out, and I'm having two of these. I'm hoping. Bubbles protects one family member from being killed or stolen. Bubbles is going to protect bubbles. Bubbles protect bubbles. Remember that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to throw this out, which means I'm going to draw two cards. Only a Reaper can kill it? Yep. Okay. So if we're wrong, please let us know in the comments. Well, the family expands with Sandra D. Meat Thief, mother. She I has work a, with Sandra D. She has an eye on your sausage. Sister, little Mims, earwax sculptor. Sometimes art comes from the inside. Now, when it says change a younger family member into an older family member, you can change a uh, kid to an uncle or a father. Like a, a son, a, you son from a father to a, to a father or uncle, or a, I think grandfather. Is it, is it no. one stage or two? Oh, maybe. I think it's I want to know if I can turn an uncle into a grandfather. Yeah, I yes, think so. yeah, oh yeah. Okay. An uncle becomes a grandfather. Mm -hmm. Sandra Deed, uh ran, tried to steal meat from the wrong person and ended up the subject of a vampire attack. A family member is now one of the undead. They cannot be killed even by a Grim Reaper. Ooh. Nice. Should probably play it so that we can make it the rules. Okay. So it cannot be killed or stolen, but can still be reaped, right? Yes. yes. You're gonna waste a reaper on one. Well, it's either that or two. You're gonna waste a reaper. I, I honestly, I don't hold. I hold on to it. someone has like three or four, and they go, "Hey, look how hard you worked!" Boom. <laughs> It's kind of a waste on a one it, or two. It helps let you cycle through cards. Yeah, yeah, no, no, go ahead, go, go ahead, yeah, play it on me now. Uh, play it on me now before I get more family members out. That's fine. <laughs> no, because I'm seeing over there, Edward. Yes. Looking very vampire-like. Yes. No, he's Edward measuring cup hands. Oh, okay, measuring cup hands. Yes. <laughs> yeah, he's gone. No, he's not. And, Jimmy Dale. And Reapers go out. Right, right. Angel's stay in, I believe. Yep. Yeah. Reapers go right. out. Ooh. Alright, now I draw up to five. One, two, three, four, five. Now, uh, the game ends when someone gets their full family free, or we go through the deck twice. Yes, then we all lose. Then we all lose. Yes. So so either one person wins or everybody loses. Are you done? Yes, I finished. Okay. Aunt T, the queen of the bung, always a bridesmaid, comes out. I draw two cards. Papa Wrinkles, nasal hair uh, contortionist, the original manscaper. I am not throwing anything out, I'm not playing any action, so I will draw one card. So. Checking it. Oh, comes the brother, Jim Jong Hill. Big brother, future supreme leader. Sure, revenge for uh, revenging a revenge is uh, possibly overdoing it, but let's do it anyway. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> let's not say we did. Or, in fact, let's not say we didn't. Because hey, I'm okay. using mustard gas. Pack the mustard into the fan. <laughs> And so, discard two, two, three, four, five. Discard two, one, two. And I will draw my card. I am done. So, family feud. Kill one family member from every player's family. That's not. Food fight. Food, Food fight. fight. Food fight! Alright, so every family is safe? Yep. Okay. Cancel that card. You're welcome. Discard for five. I actually can play two family members this time. I can play Uncle Monroe and his doppelganger. One. So I will draw my one card. Go ahead. Karma! 
Pick uh, playback time. Choose a player. Wait, why are you picking on me? Look at he has four cards. He know. is tied between the first place. I have two. Two. Counts on one, two. That's half. Half of what he has, I'm half not, of what you have. I am not killing your family. Just forcing you to uh, discard their, your hand and redraw five cards. No. So, I will discard. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, well, I have Papa Ningliku. Baby Seal Clubber. Oof, 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 oof. Staying alive, staying alive. What, the grandfather? No, it's a Papa. Uh, grandfather. It's yeah. A it's a grandfather. Yes. I'm sorry about that. Then I revealed one of the cards and I. Wait, no. I have a fountain of youth for him. He's a Papa now. And I will discard this one and draw three cards. I have a Granny, I have Granny D, uh, Sandra D's mother, to the cost of Granny. Look at the top three cards of the draw pile, pick one and add it to your hand. I'm going to steal brother and sister. Nope. I'm not going to steal brother and sister. I'm going to draw two cards. Werewolf. Change any pet into a human or any human into a pet. Little Mims becomes a pet. Do you need a pet? Yes. Okay. Leaving room for Sister Moon. Taku forever. Is that what it says on the bottom? On the okay. top, it okay. says Taku forever. Okay, I thought you were reading the bottom. On the I was thinking, do you actually know how to read that? <laughs> on the bottom, I'm guessing it says, do you actually know how to read this? Probably. Mm -hmm. Or, do you have nothing in life other than reading this? Something along those lines. It is that sort of game. Yes. With two cards, and three, four, five. Okay. Mm -hmm. Granny Gojo, cover of the, um, on the prow, goes down. I do not need to steal any adult from any other family, for my people are all here. You have his whole family? Yes. I have grandfather. Okay. Grandmother. I have father because he has a fountain of youth. Okay. I have uncle, uncle. Okay. I have aunt. Okay. I have brother. Duh. Told you. Wait till. Don't. I was dealt Do this I... to be an end game. Ah, oh, that's fine. I also had this in my hand and this in my hand. Wow. Yeah, so. Okay. See what I've been wasted anyway. Yes. Yes. So that was Family Pop. We'll be back in a moment to give you our opinions. Hello, we're back to give our opinion, opinion on Family Plots. Um, like many card games, it depends on what cards you get and how fast you cycle through them. I was dealt some very good modifiers and I decided I'm going to keep these things. I had um, Doppelganger, I had the Phantom of Youth, I had Unicorn Tears, but I had so many things I was keeping because, yeah, these are great cards that I wasn't cycling through cards fast enough to build my family. Eventually, it meant sneaking a win at the end, but that was because people were ignoring me. And I had many angels. I had unicorn tears, two angels drawn at random. Other than that, you know, it was a fun game. It has a nice, um, irreverent tone to the card, funny to play. I backed it, so I have this special sleeve. I have a bunch of expansions for it. They don't fit in the box. Uh, so we only play with the base game here. I backed it on, basically the only reason I backed it, a friend of mine wanted to, uh, was interested in it, she didn't have a Kickstarter account, so I figured, well, I'll back it, oh, and we'll just get a copy. I do like this game, it's a take that game, it's a very simple, basic take that game, it's one that, you know, someone can sort of skyrocket to a victory without anyone noticing, <laughs> and, uh, which is, like I say, it's not going to be my go-to game. But it is a lot of fun to play. Like I say, if you if you if you just want some silly fun, kill some time. Although it can go long because you've got six or your seven family members out. Reaper, 
gone. Everything you work for gone. Mm -hmm. And this can happen. There's four reapers and there's other cards that will kill off family members. So like I say, it can go for it can go for a while. First time I so played it, I think we played for we about half two. But like I say, it's it's fun. It's one of those games where you have to be in a silly mood to want to play it. If you're looking for a serious game, this is not it. No. If you want something that's you know silly, simple, and there are some things where you're going to have to come up to an agreement on because it's worded oddly. And if you think we came to a weird conclusion for the bubbles protecting things, well, I mean, it could only protect thing if it only protected things on the turn it was laid. That didn't make much sense. So. No. Anyhow, if you could disagree with that, please leave a comment. Or even if it can, uh, if it can, can uh, protect himself. Yes. So. If, but I think that's all we really have to say about this. It's, it's a really fun game. If you want to buy it, you have to go to their Kickstarter page. Go to, uh, there's a link this, uh, for Late Pledge. And you have to do a Late Pledge to buy it. Which is really odd, so I'll put a link to the Kickstarter page in the description. Uh, other than that, I, s I also put a link to their website, but th that's how you'll have to order it. You have to go through and do a late pledge, even though it's been delivered for a while now. Yes. I think that's all we have to say about it. It is fun. It is... Basically, it's, uh, it's wor I think it's worth the money. It was a pretty cheap game. It's worth the money. If you like take that games, if you like, like simple little card games like that. I don't think there's so much more to say nope. about it. That's basically it. If you like what you've seen, please like, subscribe, and comment. We love getting comments. Uh, other than that, I think that's all we have to say. Thank you for watching. Have a good evening.